got to what's supposed to be sound check. I said what's supposed to be better be a sound check. But yeah, we got we got here to sound check. Um, I came to show last night to make sure just to see what we do, to see what things had happened, technical difficulties. Big Daddy came, Mike wasn't on, he came on stage last night, so I realized that was one of the things I need to make sure that you know, doesn't happen tonight because we got so many people rapping a show with this many artists at this level. You gotta do sound check. You gotta come to sound check. Um, you gotta make sure it's right. So we in New Orleans. I gotta find some vegan food. We trying to find good vegan food. It's a small little place. You know what I mean? I don't know what area of town we in, but um, we got some Jamaican colors. <laughs> it's a black-owned vegan restaurant in New Orleans. I always find a black-owned vegan restaurant. Make sure if you want to be vegan or you trying to be vegan, follow me. And I'm going to show you what you need to eat. So, this should be one of the biggest sets that rap in general is talking about. But I feel like just because we labeled it and titled The South Got Something to Say, and we, right. you know, it, it feels like a southern show as opposed to the globalness of hip hop. But it's, you know. The artist that's involved with the set is the biggest artist in the world. Right, right, right. Yeah. What to you does hip hop mean? I mean, you've been in the industry for so long, curating not just hip hop, other you know other genres, but specifically for you, how how is hip hop important? Um, for me, hip hop is my life because I mean I'm basically the same age as hip hop. If that's the case, right? <laughs> the case so, so uh, I am hip hop. Everything about me and everything the way I grew up and just like the way I grew up, I'm an example of what hip hop. Um, is and the, the breathing example. Of the I can look around and I can see everybody and make me feel a little bit better. Now I gotta be paying attention to these niggas that's out there working. <laughs> as a kid, as a kid growing up, I always heard the dopest music coming from Atlanta. This is my inspiration. This is what I made of. This is my most patient. Keeping my soul, soul. Let's go! Well, everybody, make a race to clean, clean. 